This is the hip thrust march. Same idea, technique as the bridge march, but our shoulders are going to be elevated on the bench just like every other hip thrust position. So if you do not have any weight, it's a simple setup with the shoulders on the bench to, to get a comfortable pivot point. We're going to bring our feet together until they touch. Once I'm in that good position, somewhat of a 90 degree angle in my knees, I'm going to lift one leg, lift my hips to ensure that I'm in a parallel position. Knee in line with hip, hip in line with shoulder. Once I'm here, I'm squeezing through the glute of the downside leg, in through the heels, not through the toes. I'm going to switch position without dropping my heels for the allotted amount of reps. Make sure that you're not pushing through the toes and lifting the heel. Make sure you're emphasizing the heel and even lifting the toes if you need to. If your head gets tired, hands behind the neck or the head to keep that in line as you continue to rep out. 